What's up, Anchor and Addicts, or whatever you want to call yourself? Uh, yeah, so this is a, a, a dad. I'm in the shower. But I just gotta say, I just made my first Anchor podcast. Um, it was about a half an hour long. And uh, Anchor is the easiest way to make a podcast. It was literally simple. I press a button, it turns on. Uh, Anchor gives you, you know, everything you need in one place. Uh, you can do it right from your phone, and, or, you know, if you have a laptop or a computer or tablet, that you can just do it from. Um, the tools, they allow you to record and, and edit your podcasts. So, of course, you know, you could add little snippets in there or uh, take out things that you didn't want in there. Um, but the good thing about it is they'll also distribute it for you, so you can, uh, so you can be heard anywhere you want to, like on Spotify or Google Podcasts, uh, Pod, uh, Apple Podcasts. You can easily make money from your podcast, too. Uh, you know, and they, they tell you and walk you through all the steps. And the good thing is, you know, you can download it now. Download it now. Because I've heard this from Gary V, Gary Vaynerchuk. I've heard this app going out there a long time for about a year or two. Um, that it's just easy. It's easy to use. And I know this ad is long, but I don't care. Uh, but you can download it now on uh, go to anchor.fm to get started. It's A N C H O R dot F M to get started. Let me finish my shower, okay? Hey guys, so I stopped the video and I don't know when. I don't know why I did that, but I stopped the video. So. Here's me doing it again, of course. Plugging in my light here, sorry. That's why I stopped the video, not meaning to, because I had to plug this in because it was dying. So, yay, awesome. Round two, right? No, nah, not really. I just... I'll just, just summarize what I just said. I went to sleep, slept about five hours, but I'm good. Yeah, <laughs> that's what I did. I, I didn't uh, didn't do much. Watched the draft and uh, it was pretty awesome doing that with my son. You know, I, I laid on I laid on their bed watching it in their bedroom and, and uh, my son was all excited. He, uh, he kind of called it, uh, who was going to get drafted to who. Uh, that was just the first three picks. After that, I didn't even honestly know who those kids are, honestly. I don't, I don't, I didn't even watch college basketball at all. I just know the, the first top three. I knew some other people that were supposed to get drafted, but I didn't look to see if they got drafted yet or not. But I just knew they weren't number one or number five or number two. 10 or anywhere from the top 10. I, I just um, I haven't really looked. Anyways. I filled up my jug because not because it was empty but I, I, <laughs> I had to wash it because I hadn't washed it in a week and then there was some floaties in it and it didn't look cool. And that was probably for me anyways but I normally just I normally take it, rinse it out, and I do that every time, but I don't wash it every time. So it sounds a little gross, but I just don't have a jug big enough to put all, uh, a whole gallon of water in it. So and sometimes I drink more than a half a gallon of water, uh, and sometimes I drink more than that. I, it really depends on the day for me, because when I'm working, uh, sometimes I'm literally sweating everywhere, like everywhere. Uh, I don't know if anyone notices it, but like from uh, 
anywhere from above my eyebrows. <laughs> I'm glad I'm wearing a mask, I, I can tell you that, because it catches a lot of the sweat right up here, and it doesn't get in my face, and I can talk, you know, just, it's cool that way. But, uh, yeah, I sweat a lot, and uh, it's been more prevalent a little bit more recently, because I just, my motor's a little bit higher, I'm trying to push it a little bit more. Um, I don't really care to see if people notice it or not. That's not even my intentions. My intentions are just to try to work. Like I'm trying to, I'm trying to get my body to where I need it to be. And until that happens, you know, I'm just gonna keep pushing it. You know, I know that if I didn't have a job or an actual physical manual labor job, I'd have to supplement by doing something else. So this really, really helps, to be honest. So. I, kind of an excuse to say, hey, I'm going to go, I'm going to go work out, you know, then that's technically what I'm doing, you know, I mean, I'm not, I'm not really doing much, to be honest, I work with numbers and letters and matching and, you know, opening boxes, uh, I mean, there's a lot of things involved, but it's all pretty basic stuff, uh, so, I mean, there's not much to think about, to be honest, so the rest of it is filled with, uh, listening to music, uh, thinking about things, going through things in my head. Like I, <clears throat> I really do get a deep, uh, a deep thought interaction with myself, I guess you want to say, uh, just working because, you know, I'm not normally with someone. So it's not like I'm talking to anyone really all night long. I mean, it's not, it's not like that is never not a thing. Sometimes we do work with people, but uh, most of the time we just by ourselves. And so you gotta have that interaction uh, with you and the music or someone talking or nothing, complete science, uh, silence. Uh, I mean, whatever it is to you, but it's, it's that focus that you have to have in order to not stray off and, and do something else than what we're supposed to be doing, right? So uh, anyways, I go through that process, the thinking, all that stuff, and, and, and I find enjoyment, and that's where my my balance is, because I know I have to work, right? I know I have to come in and do all this stuff. Uh, this is just, you know, you know, an adult thing, but while I'm doing this, you know, there's, there's a lot of uh, things that I know that I can and hopefully try to Im improve uh, on in my life uh, for my kids, for me being a husband, whatever it is, uh, me being a better worker, I don't know, thinking about, uh, shoot, what I can do five minutes from now and the next project that I have to work on while I'm at work. I mean, there's, there's multiple things that goes on in my head. Uh, but I, I find balance when I'm able to, to multitask and do a whole bunch of things all at once because uh, it just streamlines the whole night. So I get my workout. I find my balance. Uh, I'm not saying it's the best work, but I do all of that. And then I hopefully get, in, get tired enough, go home. Go to bed, rinse and repeat. That's kind of how Groundhog Day is, I guess, in a sense. But, hey, it works out like that, I guess. I'm going to talk to you later. Have a great night.